Think about your past self right now. Think about specifically about all the times you said, one more game, bro. One, okay, just one more step. Just one last time. I'll start tomorrow. I'm gonna wake up at 5 a.m. and start tomorrow. Just five more minutes, bro. Just five more minutes. Think about all these times. Now, when was the last time you did this? Now, whether it was yesterday or a year ago, are you proud of that? If it was recently that you had this mindset, oh, and if you still have this mindset, like, oh, five more minutes, just one last time, and it's been the last time for the past 3,000 times, you need to change, bro. How can you be okay with that? I mean, think about three months ago. What if you started then? I mean, does that regret not make you angry? Does that not make you mad? Does it not fill you with regret? How can you do the same thing you did three months ago and expect a different outcome? One plus one is always gonna equal two. Now look at your past self objectively. Like, forget about time frame. Do you think you genuinely got better in character and discipline and doing the hard work and consistency, everything? Do you think you genuinely got better? You know, for me personally, if we combine all my life together into one, I would say, I would say I'm not consistent. I'm not any of the things I prescribe. Because I've been on, compared to the, my whole life, I've been on self-improvement for a very short amount of time, right? I mean, if I was born when I started self-improvement, I'm literally like two years old. So now if you're in the same position as me, think about the past few months. Think about the past year. Think about the past two years. And ask yourself the same questions. Were you consistent? Did you apply what you learned? Did your character get better? Did your discipline get better? If you say, yes, I was consistent. I did the good habits. I stayed far, far away from even going near the bad habits and it gave me amazing results. I'm grateful for my past self. I don't look at my past self with hate, anger, and regret anymore. If that's you, congratulations. Say the same exact thing in a year. If that's not you and you were consistent, you didn't do the hard work, you had absolutely zero discipline and relied fully on that 5 a.m. type motivation. If you try learning a bunch of things but apply absolutely none of them, Make a change, bro. It might not be the first time you've done this. It's, I've definitely done it multiple times and so many people have done it multiple times. You don't wanna say the same thing in three months, four or five months, a year from now. I've created so many YouTube channels like this and I had really, really good videos, but I was never consistent with it. You know, I was consistent for maybe like two weeks and then every single month I make a video like, oh, you're probably wondering where I've been the last month or something. If I was consistent, a year ago, two years ago, I would be in such a different position. I don't wanna say the same thing in a year. So to my future self, are you grateful for me? Are you proud of me? Do you look at me with happiness and gratitude or do you hate me? Does your mind fill with regret every time you think about me? If you don't know me already, my name is Zaid. My goal is to create a community of young Muslim men and women like me who don't have to be ashamed to be Muslim anymore because I was like that for a long time. And honestly, so many Muslims of today are. Share this video with a friend because me and you will both get the reward if they gain something from it. Hit that subscribe if you agree with the movement and want to be a part of the movement. And if you don't do any of that, just make sure you apply what you've learned in this video. I'll see you in the next one.